coming up on uh, Russell Island. There's the rocky point of it, the uh, government dock or the, uh, the jetty. And quite a few boats here at anchor, so we're going to have to try and find a, a nice little spot to uh, tuck ourselves into. Well, we're now at anchor, 42 feet of water. Got 120 feet out of uh, anchor cable because I just freshly marked my cable so I know how much uh, cable I'm paying out. But here's our little anchorage spot. Got a few little boats tucked in close to us, including a real nice uh, yacht over there, Serenity now, just coming out of the bow there. And here's a Little walk through. Liz is in the galley, and we've got some vittles on, some charcuterie, uh, tzatziki dip, and whatnot. Some nice grapes. And here's our anchor position. There you go. You can see our little uh, swing circle starting to develop there. Uh, looks like we're solid in our uh, in our mooring. So we'll just keep an eye on it throughout the evening just to make sure and maybe have to pay out a little more cable, but I don't think so. And look at the uh, island. You can see the dock sort of in behind that blue boat over there. And we'll take the dinghy out. We'll launch the dinghy then go for a little bit of a joyride and check the uh, check the area out and go and see the uh, the old homestead that's on the island you can see the building in the back in behind that sailboat mast uh, they've got a lovely orchard in there and that is salt spring island and the entrance to fulford harbor you can just see the fulford harbor ferry uh, going into fulford right now from uh, victoria and lovely evening sun is out gorgeous nice and calm no wind uh, just a beautiful evening to be out at anchor it's our first anchorage of the year so we're totally excited there you go and see you can see some people on the beach over there let's see if i can zoom this bad boy yeah some folks are enjoying the beach there a little bit out of focus and then you can see the homestead I could zoom that in right you can see through the trees the uh, one of the buildings of the homestead and the jetty sorry if it's a little shaky is right there so we got a small boat dock that we can take our tire dinghy up and go for a walk there's a big trail that goes all the way around the island and it's a lovely lovely walk Went to uh, went to this anchorage before with some uh, really good friends of ours. Um, yeah, good memories. So there we have it. I'm videotaping you, and Liz is all in her little life jacket, and we're tied alongside, getting ready to go out to our bateau, which is somewhere out there. It's hidden somewhere. Well, it's hidden behind the blue boat there. Anyway, beautiful location. Here is the shoreline of the government ramp or the uh, parks ramp. Lovely location. And here we are, just doing a buzz around the boat, just to check out the uh, the hull. Liz wants me to get to a better vantage point to take some pictures. Bow shot of the Great West Rover. Oh, and Liz is giving me an indication of where she wants me to go. And lovely shot. Oh, look at that. Poor seamanship there, Liz. You got a line from the fender hanging over the side. We're going to have to dock you your pay this month. And here we are at Mountain Sunset Time. 
because obviously sunset is still quite a ways away. But we have big hills here, so what we're looking at is the last of the sun peeking out over the hills of Salt Spring Island. Over in the distance there, the, uh, to the right, is the gut of Fulford Harbor. And basically, let's see if we can zoom that bad boy in. Hopefully I'm not burning out the, uh, we got about half the disc down. And hopefully we'll get her just as she drops down. Starting to get darker, noticeably darker. <clears throat> oh yeah, about three quarters of the way down. Oh, there it's going. And... Of course, if I were lower down on the boat, it would be gone. And now she is gone, just like that. Mountain sunset is over. Let's zoom her out to a pan while we still got some good light of the anchorage. And there is Russell Island. In the backdrop, we lost the big boat that was next to us pity because it was a good lee but we've got a few hardcore sailboats in fact most of the folks here well, I'd say a good half and half I guess of sailboats and powerboats and there is the big dock that we walked up on earlier today didn't do too many videos of the island because we did uh, quite a few the last time I was here we thought we'd only take snippets of stuff we hadn't seen before, really. So there you go. Sunset, and now it's time to have a glass of wine. We just ate supper. You can see the remnants of supper down below. And uh, got our wine glasses there and ready for a nice quiet evening. And that's our yacht flag, our yacht club flag. North Saanich Marina, North Saanich, BC, Oak Bay Marine Group. So there's a few divers that I know that actually work for them. So got to keep my business there. And just after sunset, what's the last thing you got to do? Well, we got to turn on the anchor light. So there you go. Our little baby anchor light is on. Even though it's a little bit early yet, because technically we only have to do it at sunset, real sunset. So, start of a lovely evening. to home at uh, the entrance to Seal Harbor, it's Van Isle Marina on the left, and then we're heading off to a whole bunch of sticks that are on the horizon, sticking up in the air there, on the sailboats. So we're passing our day marker coming into the harbor, see all the uh, boats moored out there, we just came from out there where it's pounding pretty good actually, it was uh, a few white caps. Bit now, but uh, quite windy out there, but uh, a lot of fun. There we have it. Everything's a go. We're coming alongside.